everybody how you doing it's me Lisa I'm doing good my hair is a little funky I let it air well I usually let it air dry but I put it up in one of my clippies so it's like wicked wavy I kind of dig it though um different I wanted to and you know how like you get into a funk and you just let me make sure you guys are level and you just need to do something just to get you out of it well I did some bright makeup I did um, orange into yellow I don't know if you can tell and then these are the eyelashes I don't care for <laughs> because they're so long when you when you um, look at them they do look long but not like obnoxious long please don't take offense to anyone please don't it's just a personal preference and because I'm not used to it but I look like I got spider legs on my eyes. They're kind of cool, though, at the same time. Um, I kind of dig them, but I don't know. Do people care if your eyelashes look, like, fake, fake? But it's just, like, kind of, I feel like it. they open my eyes at the same time. And then the other ones that I got recently, the ones with, um, that are, like, uh, natural, I like them because they come out this way a little bit more, but they're not, like, I, I'm okay wearing them to work. Yeah, I should just wear these to work and see what people say. <laughs> Anywho, with that being said, where did I put it? Um, I had talked about this, was it the last video or the video before the Ioni? Um, eyeglass, eyeglass, eyelash glue, woo, I got too much, uh, brightness on my face, I guess it's gone on my head, anyway, I gotta tell you what happened, yesterday, I put on one of these, or a set of these, and, um, what was I doing? I didn't even go out. I wanted to do some kind of video because I haven't gotten my Timo orders in yet. And I think I'm, and I think it's just the weather or whatnot. But they're not late either. So, but anywho, <laughs> I fell asleep in the living room and um, Wesley wakes me up. I guess it was just a little bit before 11. I didn't even take my makeup off. That's like how out I was. I don't even remember going to bed. Let's put it that way. This glue is so good. When I woke up, the eyelashes were still on. Now, they were crooked. Like, one side was up here, and then the other side, the inside, was up here. But they weren't off. You tell me this isn't good eyelash glue. <laughs> and, of course, I went to the Dollar Tree today, and I could not find it. So, I would give it a try. Um, next time I see it I'm gonna grab another one or two of these I mean there's a lot in the bottle um, when it gets down low I may have to scrape a little bit but it's really good it really is so and I went back you know one of these eyelash things um, I got from Timo I got this kind and then I got this kind which I like but I couldn't get this to work right today it put my lashes on like I knew what I was doing <laughs> like it got it you know right a lot closer to my lash line than I normally get them with this but I like this because I can um pat them down you know like you know when I get them on and um I can squinch the lashes with my um, natural lashes. I haven't been putting mascara on my natural lashes because, ugh. but I think what I need to, I did do it today just to see. However, but I think I need to curl my natural lashes so when I wear fake lashes, it kind of all blends in. I don't know. Those of you that have tried them or wear them, um, are these too much? <laughs> and um, do you use mascara on your natural lashes to blend them in with the fake lash? And do you curl them? Okay. Um, 
another shout out. This Bella Candy I showed y'all before. Ugh. It is the, and I originally saw this from, um, hey everybody, Erin. Um, oh, I got some funk in there. Anyways, it's got a, a nice mirror here, but this is to, like, it's like a compact, but it, it um, if you're shiny, it'll get that shine out. Um, I just, all I do is go pat, 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 and do, 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 do. And I got this from Timu, and I accidentally got two. I think this is going to last a while. Um, it does not have an expiration date, but I find the makeup, skincare, and whatnot has a, a better and a longer shelf life. Not only are they closer to um, when you purchase it, like say I purchased this today, it will have um, a, a date of like November or December of 23 that it was actually made. And then you have longer time. And they seem to be like a 12 month to a 24 month. The majority of them. Unlike some of the name brands or whatnot that we we see. But anyways, I do have a second one. So, And I know I said this before. It will go into the... Um, when we get to 1,000 subscribers, they'll go in if you want. I will ask, depending if... Uh, it does not matter if you're a male or a female. I don't care. Um, I'll just ask you if you would like that. You know, you can give it to somebody else. You can use it yourself, what have you. This is a non-discrimination zone. There was something else I wanted to... Oh, oh, y'all. Remember when I got that crystal, the one with the U, that if you put, use a UV light? It will um, fluoresce. Well, and I say, watch me be looking right at it. Well, I really wasn't looking at it, but I found it, and it was right behind my mirror, my lighted mirror. It's just a tabletop one, you know, like that big. So I and I, I think this is a Uber light. I have to, or I will put the name like right here. I can't remember what it's called, but it's like a fire. A nickname is like a fire rock. But so here's what it looks like without. And then, oh, crud muffin. Oh, hold on. Let me turn this light out. Doggone it. Can you, oh, maybe that'll help. Okay, so let's put this away so it looks like that. I'm going to try. This is not the best. <sighs> I mean, I can see it beautifully. If it was... Can you see a little bit of that pinkish? Well, it is like a bright, bright, hot pink in there. And I kept looking at it and looking at it like, is this like a painted, like if it was you know, uh, something done with it. I don't think so. I'm not sure. I'm going to take a picture right now while y'all are on the phone, or on the phone, while y'all are right here with me. And hopefully, it will take... Of course not. It's not the best, but it's better than what I just did. Um, so I'll just, I'll put it here or right here. But, um, yeah. Oh, I got to turn the light back on. Okay. So I'll put the name and then I'll put the picture also. And I have a couple shout outs. The first one is... Jeannie, you are so right. My little um, cat pins I showed last time, they just disappear. 
in this thing. You are so right. I didn't even realize it until you said something. I'm like, wait a minute, let me, because I didn't put them up yet. I'm like, let me see. So, I'm going to have to get a new paper now, Jeannie. <laughs> um, I don't know if they come in different colors, but even if it's a white one, at least we'll get that contrast, right? Um... The next one, let me see, Queenie, I asked Wesley if he wanted the blanket, and you were so right, he did, so he has it, and it is super soft, it is warm, because um, you know what, when I fell asleep, when he woke me up, I do remember he had put that blanket on me. But it was, it's, it, it's thin, but it's so warm and so soft. It's in his room now, right? Um, cause he wanted it. He did want it. And, um, it's huge. I mean, it could, it would fit a good full size, maybe a queen, not like to drape down, but you know, you can get under it and there's a lot of room. Jeannie, thank you for suggesting that. I really do appreciate it. My last shout out is to Candy. Candy, thank you. Um, you know, that video, I was having a bad day, mental health day or whatever. I was just in a funk. Um, you are so right. I will try. No, I will cut out the long pauses that I have because... I went back and I'm like, gosh, those were really, really long pauses. And usually I, I'll talk, but I, you know, you know, I was off when I don't say anything. But anyway, thank you for bringing that up, and I appreciate. There's too many people that are mean when they say things, Candy. That was great constructive criticism I appreciate you so much and bringing that to light and how you brought it to me I love it um, yes I will be more aware absolutely and when I see that long pause you guys are going to see edits because you know I don't edit. <laughs> I don't I mean I edit but I don't like to cut the video up too much because I want you to see everything if that makes sense but i get if it's going too slow it's like come on lisa you're holding it up let's go let's go let's go you could have cut this out i totally get that and i have a this is the last thing <laughs> i think we're like 13 minutes i'm like da, 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 da. anywho i have this video camera that i was um I got for birthday or Christmas a couple years ago. I don't remember how, what it's called. I can't see the name of it. Anyway, it's just like one of those little handheld um, cameras you can put on a tripod and you bring out the screen. So like I can see myself right now. Um, but after 20 minutes... It like starts a new video so when I'm um, doing my edits and I don't know if you guys pick this up if it's a long video you'll see like I'll be talking and then I'll say um, I don't know uh, Timu and then a second li later Timu it's like I'm repeating myself like an echo but it's not echo sounding it's just like Timu Timu da, 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 da. do you know and it won't meld them together because the camera's making it two separate videos. It stops the original one at 20 minutes. So either I'm going to have to really pay attention at the 20 minute mark or does anybody have any idea how to tweak it? I mean it's a generic camera. It's not like one of the really good ones. Um, I went through the menu and I don't have a clue. <laughs> I'll put the name of the camera around here uh, somewhere. Um, I can't find anything unless I'm not looking in the right place. Um, if not, that's okay. I will pay more attention. Um, 
what else? I feel like there was something else. No, I said that was it, didn't I? Okay, so I went to the Dollar Tree. I have not been there <sighs> two months, two and a half months. At least it feels like that. I haven't been there in a long time. Excuse me, I am really thirsty, y'all. So, Timu do. I love these, y'all. Whether you have ice cubes or crushed ice, this keeps whatever you're drinking cold. I mean, 24 hours. Like, say I, I woke up at 6 o'clock. And I put, filled it up, you know, put ice in it, put water or whatever I want. I usually just drink water. Anyways, and just say I've been sipping on it all day. I haven't really been drinking my water that good. And I put it next to my nightstand. When I wake up, there's still ice in it. And I know I've said that before, but I just want to do another shout out. Boy, am I like rambling or am I rambling, y'all? Okay, so anyway, <laughs> I wanted to... um run to Dollar Tree because you can get um and let me just show you the Arizona drinks for a dollar twenty five where a regular size Arizona can oh gosh they're like almost two dollars like if you went up to the gas station or or even like a reg a store store. Anyway and Wesley likes the Arizona watermelon. It's like fruit juice cocktail. But it's really good. I like it too. And it's 34 ounces. So, and even they have the sweet tea, which I only got one of these. I got him four of these. I thought I got myself two because this will last me a couple of days because I try not to drink anything but water. Um... Except for my coffee. Anyway. But um, I got him four of these. I can't, I can't believe I only got five of these kind. Because I hate odd. <laughs> I usually get six. So anyway. Dollar twenty-five. You know this is going to be a lot. You know at least a dollar more. At least elsewhere. Um, I mean that's 34 ounces. So I just put it in the fridge and... When he wants something to drink, he'll just, you know, get a cup, put ice in it, and put some of this stuff in it. Um, so, instead of soda. But I don't know. Does this have a lot of sugar in it? 21 grams? This has four servings. This has four servings in it. Okay. But, anywho... It does not have any of that, I can't see, filtered fructose corn syrup, but, 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 oh, it's got kiwi juice, it's got all sorts of stuff, I'm making sure it does not have that aspartame in it, because that's really not good for you, um, I can't, it actually, you know, it will make my feet swell. My feet swell if I eat too much salt anyways. Um, but um, that I can feel it. Does that make sense? I don't know if it's all up here or if it's really whatever. <laughs> and guess what I found? I have seen other um, creators haul these like last summer and I find we finally got them at ours. We, they have the Twix iced coffee, and this is eight fluid ounces, and then they had the Snickers iced coffee. I'm like, oh, heck yeah. So I got four of each. <laughs> They're in the refrigerator. I will not drink these back to back to back to back. I am very, I am very water oriented. So like, if I open this up, I will probably just drink a little bit of it and either let Wesley have the rest, or I'll just, like, put that, what's that stuff called? It's not saran wrap, the cling wrap on it. I mean, I know, but I just, I, I, I'm not a sweet drinker. I've always drank water. I don't know. Anywho, so I got four of each. 
then it is scarce in my um, Dollar Tree. There's, they have um, a whole area for St. Patty's Day. They're starting to bring the Easter stuff in, and it's scarce for the Valentine's Day. It just looks like, you know, like how when you go in there and the walls are like jam packed, like their things are like right next to each other, but it, everything was spaced out. Okay, this is getting ready to flip. So I'm going to stop talking for one second, but I'm going to cut this out. <laughs> Still going, y'all. Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay. They had very little Valentine's. But then again, they had the Valentine's stuff out before Christmas. So, they do, they did, oh, I just got mooshed. They did have a Valentine's Day tree. It is pink, but I don't know where she is. So I picked it, picked one up for work. But that's how it looks. I don't want to open it up because if the little stinker is running around, she'll come in and attack me because she'll want this. So I'll have to, um, when I get it all up at work, I need, I'll take a picture. Okay, 21 and 57 seconds. Let's see, will it do it? It is still going, y'all. Okay. It's calling me a liar. So, I got a cup. Let me get mm. They did not have any ornaments. None. They had the trees, but they didn't have any ornaments. So... I found this mesh tubing, and it is, it's just tubing, but I'm going to use it as garland. Um, and it's kind of easy, it's shiny. Then, I'm watching this, I'm getting nervous now. <laughs> you know, I don't want to be talking and, you know, miss it, and then... Then they have the beaded necklaces. It's still going, y'all. 23 minutes. And they're hard. So they have the red and the pink. I'm going to make this into garland. To go in between the mesh. Then, I couldn't find anything, y'all. Then, this is, um, I guess you're supposed to put this on your table. It's called table scatter. But it's like little glittery felt um, hearts, and they're different sizes. I don't know. You can see they're big sizes and smaller sizes, and they have the big of the pink in there. I don't know if you can see that. So I'm like, well, shoot. How am I hang it up? So underneath it, they had red, uh, pink, pink, and then this is like a very soft pink. It looks white on here. But what I'm going to do, because this is probably half an inch, still going, 24 minutes. I must have known. Yeah, it's about a half an inch, just a titch over a half inch wide. I guess I could have looked here. Five eighths inch wide. Anyway, so can you see the hearts in there? I'm going to cut it in half, and then I'm going to put a little hole in here. And then I'm going to string it up and just decorate it that way. Then, I used to get my nails done all the time. I loved it, but it's expensive. So, I got some nails from Timu. I'm waiting for them to come. Anytime I have ever tried the, like, press-on or the glue-on nails, they never work for me like they're either too small too big whatever I couldn't whatever I couldn't can never it just flipped 25 minutes okay <laughs> anywho I can never get them to um fit right so and my nails are getting long but they chip and they peel and ugh. 
So anyways, so I decided to try out the electric nail kit. It needs one AA battery and then it has a cuticle pusher, which is this one, a buffering tool, which is this one, and then a shaping tool, which is this one. So I figured I can at least get my cuticle straight, what have you. Maybe I can, I don't know. Anyway, so I'm going to try them. So, I mean, I know I can use an emery board and they work fine, but it's just like always, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. I just always have issues. Okay, so we're going to do, okay. I don't ever buy any um, Easter candy until after Valentine's Day. Never. Um, only because I feel like, oh, I just can't do that, you know? I feel like I'm being, I don't know. It just, I don't know. I've never bought Easter candy until after Valentine's Day. However, <laughs> They've got their peeps in, and I love peeps. So, and they have different flavors now. But I got my blue ones, pink ones, yellow ones. And I put these in the freezer, and if I ever, if I want something, I'll go in and I'll, like, take a chick off. So they had the cotton candy, sour watermelon, and I've never seen this flavor before. Dr. Pepper. I am so scared. I can't imagine. I think I tried the cotton candy. I tried the flavor last year. I don't remember what it was, but I couldn't I couldn't taste it. So we're gonna try this. So there they be. Oh look at that poor chick. <laughs> so and I love these frozen. Okay, ready? <laughs> it is it's Dr. Pepper. I taste it. I freaking taste it. I can't believe it. Anywho, it's not like in your face and it's not immediate, but I still taste it now. It's subtle, but it's like you take, took a baby sip of Dr. Pepper. It's not, it's not strong. These are good. I usually don't like anything but my regular chicks but then again i don't usually try the other flavors except for the one i tried last year i think it was cotton candy diary i know i already said it anywho i'm impressed so now i'll have to put these in the freezer and see if they still taste the same <laughs> then i got i love these things i got it i get them and um put them in the pantry like i get us little candy bars or whatnot and I put them in the pantry so that in a little bucket so that if any of us either of us want something it's there it's we don't just get it and eat all of it at once but I love these things these are salted nut rolls and I got two of them but they're I don't know if you've ever tried them let me see I gotta get this wait my hands right here it's got like a cream in there and it's sweet but it's not disgusting sweet and it's got like a caramel over it and then the nuts it's salt and sweet and salt together i love it i heard a cat the neighborhood cats usually come over here I used to feed them but then I had like six cats I couldn't catch them because I they, we have a program here 
where you can um, take them to get spay or neuter for almost nothing or they'll do it for free. Um, Wesley said there was three of them fighting on our porch. But I haven't fed them since last year. Um, we have a lot of them. We have a lot of them. And it breaks my heart. But I got my girls in here, so... Anyway, I can't have any more cats inside. Um, but when it gets hot out, I'll have water and everything. Everybody in the neighborhood puts food and water out. So I'm not being cruel, I promise you. It breaks my heart. But, um, so there's three of them out there and two of them were fighting or arguing with each other. And I think there's a female in heat. I haven't heard her, but it was the first time I could hear a cat outside all from out back here all the way into the living room. And Wesley looked, he said he must have scared him when he, um, opened the blind because he didn't see them. I had a, anywho. So, I don't let them go without, I always, and I do have like a kennel out there that has um, an old blanket and some old towels, and I have a blanket that covers it for bad weather. Because <coughs> I worry, I don't want them to freeze to death. And... One time, one of the cats had kittens by the um, fence door and in the neighbor's yard. And um, he was like, is this your cat? And I'm like, no, this is, she's a feral cat. I, I mean, I she hadn't even come up to the porch at that, that time. But um, last year, she did bring her last two years she has brought her little she's had her littles underneath my steps outside so at least she can bring them up in there um, if need be I just don't know what to do I don't know what to do um, my neighbor says she'll help me we talked about this um, I just don't want anything bad to happen to them it's like darned if you do darned if you don't I don't know anyway Okay, last thing. My, I have one bulb left that's actually working in my bathroom. And they're the big round ones. I got four of these. And they do fit. Usually they have the, uh, they're white. This is the first time I'm getting a clear. I have never had, I don't know what brand they are. Um... Distributed by Greenbrier. So it is Dollar Tree. Um, so I got four of them. Um, these work and they last a long time. So if you have these bulbs, they even have the spotlight bulbs. You know, like they're flat. They're like this, but they kind of have a, a very small dome, like, you know, like this. Um, they have, I've seen those, or those, there's a bunch of them there, and probably because, you know, spring is upon us, um, and they have had regular light bulbs, um, some of the old kind regular light bulbs, and also the LED ones, so, when I need a light bulb, I go to Dollar Tree, y'all, it's cheaper, and they last just the same. Just saying. I feel like there's something else I need to say. I am so upset that rock didn't come out. I was like, yes, I found it. Um, hopefully, if this picture didn't come out, I'll try a different angle or whatever. But yeah, I hope y'all are having a wonderful day or evening. I had a good weekend can't wait till my Timu stuff gets here. It's like, everything's like, you get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, and then there's this long... <clears throat> I swear I have a small bag somewhere and I can't find it. I must have put it in another bag. Um, 
of team of stuff that y'all haven't seen because we did you know my bedroom I just like put a bunch of stuff away when um, we went to Tennessee and um, my neighbor came in to uh, cat sit um, just to tidy it up you know um, but anywho I don't know where I was going with that um, oh what I do if y'all I see a lot of creators with their Timu hauls um, They'll get like two or three orders in a bag. Mm -hmm. That drives me nuts. And I don't, sorry, my, I forgot to put my phone on. Do not disturb. I just put it over there. Um, in one bag. I wait. If you, So, say I make a purchase today. I'll wait. Usually the next day, like tomorrow, it'll say it's shipped. Then, once it has the tracking number, then I'll order. But I usually, like, like if I order today, I'll get the thing saying, it's been shipped. I'll usually, and it's usually later on in the afternoon. Um, the next day, I'll order. And, knock on wood, I have gotten my orders separately. Um, I don't know if any of you do Timu hauls. Or what not, but something to try. Um, yeah. Oh, I also got, um, picked back up a subscription box and bag that I used to love. And, but I stopped it be just because, you know, money. And I probably shouldn't have picked it back up, but I really enjoy it. And if I don't, use a product I will put it in um, our box of giveaway stuff um, but it's the ice cream beauty I'm sure y'all have seen that and there was another one I thought I got oh I got the Walmart one it's quarterly it's seasonal I should say and it's like seven dollars but I did get the there's this super I can't remember what it's called super something or other 17 dollars but it comes in a tin and it's got a bunch of stuff in it so I'll show that to y'all um, when that comes because I used to get that and I really did like it because you'll get full size items or um, deluxe items and you do get samples like a lot of my hand cream and stuff they'll like send Cetaphil or what's the other one and I take those to work. I love them. And it gives you a chance to try something. So, but I was also getting really inundated with stuff. Like I am now with Timu. <laughs> but anywho. Um, oh, I wanted to show, I think I showed this to you guys before. I'm going to have to stand back a little bit. I love this shirt. I wore this. Every once in a while I wear this on a Friday. I'm a multitasker. I can listen, ignore, and forget uh, all at the same time. <laughs> That's a Friday shirt, but I wore it today. Anywho, no matter where you are or when you are, whether it's morning, afternoon, evening, or night, until next time, go share your smile. Bye. <laughs>